We have the four-chamber heart, that's the four living creatures in the sea of glass, that's the pericardium, that's the throne of God, that's the thundering and the lightning and the voices. That's where we are so far. So far, everything that John sees in heaven is matched in this body. Now let's go to the next part. And there were seven lamps of fire burning before the throne, which are the seven spirits of God. Notice that you have two lungs. Again, anything that's two, right and left, is usually going to be a representation of the Old Testament and the New Testament. And I want you to think about this. Your lungs represent where the body receives the breath of life. Where does the breath come from? Do we have a tube that comes out of our armpits? One that comes out of our belly button? No. The air, the breath of life, it always comes from the head, always. And by the way, it comes from uh, three main sources. The mouth, right nostril, left nostril. For three that bear record in heaven, the Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost. And these three are one. Because whether I breathe in with my nose or I breathe in with my mouth, I, my, I'm a mouth breather at night. When I go to sleep, my jaw just drops open. I breathe through my mouth. But no matter whether it comes in through my nose or my mouth or both at the same time, it all ends up as one going down into the body. All right? And I like this. Take a look at your lungs. Again, one represents the New Testament, one represents the Old Testament. Now, there's some who say, well, you know, the Old Testament, that was for Israel, that's not for us. And the New Testament, that's only for us. And do you know that when your body takes in the breath, and the breath then in your lungs is distributed to your heart, your heart then takes that oxygen-rich blood and distributes it to the body. Did you know that your right hand is not necessarily the recipient of the breath that came in or that comes in through the right lung. Neither does your left hand only get air from the left lung. That by the time it's transferred into the bloodstream by way of uh, the brachial tubes, and we're going to see that in a minute, and goes into the heart, and the heart then puts it, you know, distributes that blood to the body, it doesn't really matter where or what lung or what nostril that breath comes from. 